that satisfy uh, associative law exists an element called identity, the second, and every element have inverse. I think everybody uh, know this definition. Usually example for groups uh, are Z, R, C, and C groups. <coughs> And uh, you know quarter young groups well. Usually we use the concept of a subgroup for a group and we can consider right courses or left courses of the sub. -group. If uh, we consider uh, a special uh, kind of a subgroup called normal subgroup, we can obtain from the quotient a group. Martin, the first person that considered the notion of a hybrid group with uh, supposing the quotient when the subgroup is not normal. Uh, this is the first motivation for consideration of a hybrid group. Now I want to explain about uh, two generalization of a group. Uh, in this definition, uh, this definition is uh, equivalent to uh, first uh, definition of a group. In this definition, uh, you cannot see the identity and the inverse. You have only associative law and uh, two equations for each K and B, the equation uh, solvable. This definition of a group is equivalent to another definition. Exist two generalization of a group. The first uh, begins in uh, this year by <coughs> Dorant. Here, uh, you can see the definition of n array group. We have uh, a generalization of associated law. Uh, first, I must uh, tell you uh, we have uh, n array operation instead of binary operation. We consider G cross G cross G to G. And we have a equation <coughs> that for every A and B is solved. Another generalization of hypergroups is when we have a hyper operation instead of operation. When we combine two elements, we obtain a set. So here we have the equality of sets. And the second, called reproduction axiom, is also a generalization of the second condition in the definition of group. Weak hyperstructures that begin in uh, 20 years ago by Thomas 
would you please? In this uh, structure, instead of associated result, we have weak associated. So the intersection must be non weak. The next definition may be the more interested for purpose of scientific since we like a hyperstructure with unit. Yes. Uh, this uh, I call this structure multivalent system. We have a set, uh, a hyper operation, an identity, and a unary map. This structure must uh, satisfy the following as well, axioms. One, weak associated, two, identity, and three is an axiom same that we have in groups. Uh, here you can uh, see a uh, motivation example for weak polygroups groups when we have an equivalence relation on set G, which satisfies two axioms. Then the quotient give us a weak polygroup. In this table, you can uh, see another example of the polygon, big polygon. Uh, you can see this structure uh, satisfy weak associated that is not associated. And uh, in this definition, uh, you can combine two polygons to obtain a, a big weak polygons. Uh, at this section, I provided uh, some <coughs> definition and axiom uh, from Santini and Lujuki's papers. <coughs> Since <coughs> would you please before me explain about this subject, I think it's better I go to another section to explain about fuzzy Lee algebra. Uh, 
the concept of quasi sets is a generalization of ordinary set that introduced by Zal. Usually, uh, in classical logic, we use 0 and 1. But many phenomena in real world uh, are not only 0 or 1. All things are not black or white. Something we have a range between 0 and 1. can see the definition of the algebra and their axiom. And uh, the definition of uh, sub-algebra and the admissibility here. The definition of an ideal of a subspace we have here. We can define uh, the homomorphism between to the algebra. Uh, here uh, you can see the definition of the positive sets. You can consider a fuzzy set as a subset, uh, as a function, move from x to unit interval 0, 1. When move and lambda are two fuzzy subsets of a set, say x, we say that move is contained in lambda if move of x is equal is less than lambda of x for all x. Also, we can define intersection and union of sets. The definition of image and inverse image of the positive sets also can define. When who is a fuzzy subset of X, we can define a set called level subset of our fuzzy sets. <coughs> First, uh, <coughs> for definition of fuzzy ideal of the new algebra, we need to define the definition of fuzzy subspace. When uh, we is a vector space or a field, a fuzzy subset group of D is called a fuzzy subspace if it can uh, satisfy the following condition. First, mu of x plus y greater than minimum of mu of x and mu of y. Uh, it is a generalization of uh, our binary operation. Angle of minus x greater than mu of x. And for every alpha in A, mu of alpha x greater than mu of x. The next theorem we give a relation between ordinary fuzzy sets, a fuzzy subspace, and uh, ordinary subspace, and a fuzzy subspace. This theorem uh, tell who is a fuzzy subspace if the level set is ordinary subspace. And in the next definition, we can consider a fuzzy ideal of a Lie algebra. A fuzzy ideal of a Lie algebra must be fuzzy subspace that satisfies the last axiom. 
about our bureaucracy. Here uh, you can see some examples about fuzzy uh, IP update in the algae. <coughs> and uh, here uh, we have several vocabulary <coughs> and memo about our definition. I think the definition of fuzzy linear algebra, I gave it about uh, eight years ago. But I would like to find uh, some applications of uh, these definitions. <coughs> this theory give us again a relation between fuzzy ideal of linear algebra and ordinary ideal of a linear algebra. And here we can obtain from a linear algebra and a fuzzy ideal of our the algebra, the quotient the algebra that are non metals follow color world and you. This if you <coughs> ask uh, H group combination of two elements of this group give us H B groups. Another example about biology. Uh, I don't want to explain about uh, the material of the subject, but I would like to show you this table about Belut groups. If you consider combination of Belut groups, you obtain HV semi groups. And here we obtain some uh, HV subgroups of this structure. This example is uh, uh, from a new paper of me that uh, is under review, but uh, the journal is information science, and uh, the report of uh, theory libraries uh, are positive. In this section, uh, I want to uh, introduce the notion of in array hyperbolas. If you remember, I uh, told you that we have two generalizations of groups. One in array group, another hypergroup. About four years ago, me and Professor Rujiu, please, introduce the notion of NRA hypergroups. The notion of NRA hypergroups uh, combined the two generalization of groups that exist previously. And uh, <coughs> many people work on this subject. Here we can consider uh, the definition of uh, n array hybrid. Uh, this uh, equality may be uh, 
for first time B half. But if you consider n equal to 3, n equal to 3, then for associative law, we need when n equal to 3, for associative law, we need five element. And all equality is two equality. F parenthesis x1, f parenthesis, f x1, x2, x3, close parenthesis, x4, x5. Then change the parenthesis. And uh, this is a generalization of the equation in the definition of a group and also a generalization of uh, equation in hypergroup, also in a hypergroup. So we can say this definition collect all previous uh, definitions. And uh, here we can define commutative NRA hypergroup is called identity, etc. Uh, also, here we can define uh, neutral element. And here uh, we define the notion of in any sub <coughs> And several results you can see here. Uh, in the last section, I want to explain about uh, gamma semi groups. Uh, when you consider uh, Two matrices, two matrices, matrices A, B, M, cross N, matrix B, B, M, cross N, you cannot multiple, multiply uh, these matrices. Uh, in this notion, we use uh, a set called gamma for uh, work same uh, catalysis idea. Also for map, if you know uh, linear algebra, when we have two linear transformations <coughs> from a vector space to another vector space, for example, V and W, you cannot uh, combination this uh, two map or two trans uh, formation since we have not uh, uh, same size. With uh, this definition, you can also multiply the matrices uh, that uh, are not square. Let M be a set, gamma also a set. Then M is called a gamma semi group if there exists a mapping from M times gamma times M to M. And write by this notation, we can consider associative law in this case, we have a gamma C. <coughs> uh, note that uh, the gamma can change every time. When gamma change, it's same to change your operation. Uh, here, 
I mentioned the example that I explained. If M is the set of M times M matrices and gamma is the set of <coughs> some M times M matrices or <coughs> numbers, then we can <coughs> multiply our matrices as you see. Another definition is a generalization of the notion of gamma symbol. Here we can consider the notion of gamma symbol hyperplane. If for every gamma in gamma, x gamma y is a subset of our set, that is S, and we have associative law, then we say we have gamma semi hyper. Also, we can define gamma hypergroup if uh, S and gamma is a hypergroup for every gamma in gamma, then S is called a gamma hyper. Uh, the last formula is our definition about uh, combination of two sets regarding the gamma. A gamma B is equal to the union of A gamma, the set of A gamma B in A, A and B in B. And also, we can consider another notation, A gamma B, union of A gamma B, when all A, all B, and all gamma is for unit. Also, after this definition, we can consider the notion of sub gamma symbol. I think also we can uh, use uh, this definition for uh, admissible the algebra. These are the subjects that uh, from this morning is in mind. Uh, since you use uh, you usually, you usually use the S-square matrices, yes? But this provides us our matrices not be square. And uh, here we have uh, some examples of uh, our definition. some examples with tables, and finally the list of references. Uh, some of them uh, are all. I would like to show you some uh, new references. Reference uh, number nine, uh, a paper regarding the experimental example of ternary hyperstructure <coughs> that published in New York in much communication in mathematical and computer chemistry. A very good uh, journal about <coughs> math and chemistry. Uh, reference number 12 is the first paper 
the bulge in any hyperbolas. Hurricanes number thirty and forty. A part in high hyperbolas that are published in high journal in mathematics, communication algebra, and international journal of algebra and computation. If everything is about biological example of the structures, I call it inheritance example of algebraic hyperstructures. And uh, you can see other references uh, about uh, application of this subject paper of Professor Santini. Uh, excuse me, the book of Professor Santini, uh, five of you, I think, yes? <coughs> and uh, other references belong to Professor Santanila and Rujinus. Space, we can have 26 dimensions. Ah. We can have uh, this. What would your uh, group theory tell us? Yes, yes, I must. We can define, I think, about 30 kind of hyper vector space. Yes, the yeah, chain reaction you use. What kind of reaction did you use for ternary system? Yeah, uh, ternary system. Uh, uh, n hypergroup when n is equal to 3. So when we consider n. Okay, the, 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 the chain reaction oh. you mentioned, is, which chain reaction did you yes. apply to? Yes. If you have a triple system, A, B, C, yes. we can, uh, which is trilinear, we can um, uh, extract three bilinear combinations A, B, B, C, A, C, etc. So the question is, do you see any possibility of formulating legal system in terms of hyperstructure? This is the question. Yes, any indeed. Connection? That's good enough. Yeah. Yeah. I can yeah. it yeah. must. It must, because, uh, yes, it will be very interesting physically. Yes. Oh, yes, very interesting, yes, indeed. Because you have a multitude of multiple of results. I think here uh, I wrote uh, the definition of the in our uh, <coughs> yes, yeah, I remember, yes. Ah, yes, yes. I think we can uh, use this definition for your foundation. Very well. But I was <coughs> suggested to write a paper in this, um, you'll be the first, you know, in the, yeah. I think, you know, the, the treatment of triple system and my structure, it will be very interesting. Yes. I like to give it to you.